O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Happy Cinco de Mayo. To begin, a great relationship, know what you want. Know what the needs of your body are, what the needs of your mind are, what, fit, what fits well with you. There are millions of men and women, and some of them make a good match and others won't. The two years only need to be like a key and a lock, a match that works. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 143, NASDAQ is down 17, S&P is up 9, gold contract up $8.70, trading 1784 an ounce. You got silver flat, $26.50 an ounce, light sweet crude, off 26 cents, $65.44 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10-year note up 5 ticks. 132.19, the 30-year up eight at 158.08 in King Dollar. King Dollar is uh, up 26 ticks, trading 91.314. Euro is at 119, yen's at 109, and the British pound is at 139 to one US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Wanna know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at it. What do you have? Well, you're setting up a small ABC structure on the way down. That's how this baby, uh, looks to me at this particular point. So, what you have in the S&P out here today, bottom line, this is what we did. Uh, but you get down hard yesterday, uh, big volume, did uh, 101 million shares, you'll only come in into 81. You're popping up today with 40, bottom line, this thing's gonna be right back down into the lows of yesterday, that's on the SPY. We take a look at the Dow Industrials, Dow Industrials are just hanging at all time highs. And this is where, where folks, is that you're going to see the aspect of different indices topping at different times. The reason I'm saying that is that the Dow Industrials has hit an all-time high out here today, 34,039. We're at 34,267 right now. And if you close, now watch how subtle this is gonna be. If you close under 256, which of course is only uh, eight points away, that's gonna be a failure on price and volume as you hit highs. NDX 100, whole different animal. NDX 100 looks to me that, you know, you got a short-term top that's in. You came down hard. NASDAQ's having a hard time holding any type of price at all. Bottom line, Q's got the 333.14. It was a gift this morning, no doubt. You're at 329.51. You're going to see this uh, high-volume low from yesterday get tested. Uh, R, it's an ABC structure on the way down. This is a classic slow roll to the downside folks that's that's how this baby is shaking out yesterday what we did we did 65 million shares on the way down you did uh, thir you've done 34 million thus far bottom line it wants lower price if we go to the iwm and we look at the small caps same type of setup inside the small caps came down hard yesterday you're down 95 cents gold gold contract not only held price it wants higher price this thing wants the bust top side what we have inside the gold contract is this Yesterday, what you did is this. We got to a higher high, had huge volume, and then gave it up on price. What yesterday, what you did is this. You get the 1799.50. You basically closed the session out at 1769. When you look at this volume, though, it did two. 247,000 contracts. Well, the 247,000 contracts was going into 163. This thing wants to blow away this B point, and I suspect what you have, what you have out here today is that we rejected lower price at 1769. You're at 1784. This thing is building cause to blow away this uh, swing point. So it's gonna be pretty intense watching this whole thing shake out. We gotta take a look at the silver contract. What do you have with silver? Silver wants 30 bucks. Right now, what, you, what we had with silver yesterday, same setup, silver, much higher price, had the volume behind the move. And we have out here today is that you you're rejected lower price at the 2627. What's sticking out like a sore thumb is thirty dollars and four cents. Notes and bonds, uh, no doubt, some of the most intriguing ones. Not only looking at but understanding where we are inside the marketplace. So picture. So we the the Fed the Treasury is coming out. They're going to push a huge amount of notes out and bonds out. That being said, guess what? They're still buying them hand over fist. 
Uh, this note and bond market, right now you're up five ticks on the 30-year. And what the 30-year did yesterday also is come into a swing point, had monster volume coming into the swing point. This thing's going to blow away the swing. Yesterday we did 1.9 million contracts, folks, coming into the swing. The last swing out there had 1.4. That's saying it's going to blow by the swing. My take is that you're going to see the 10-year get up to the 135, and right now you're at 132. Percentage-wise out here on the 10-year, you're at 1.57, and it has been going down versus going up. We look at King Dollar. King Dollar's a toss-up right now. We'll see whether King Dollar can basically get a bounce going. What has happened thus far is this. King Dollar traded up to 91.436 today. You're at 91,317, and you're hanging up there, okay? The bottom line is that King Dollar can get a bounce up to the 91,764. That'd be pretty easy to do, actually. You know, all that would be is that, well, actually, let, let's look at it, percent uh, Fibonacci-wise, as to what, whoops, there we go, as to what that would be. So, come on, baby, where are you? King Dollar, DXY, it's trying to hide. See, it doesn't... It, that basically, uh, okay, so let's see what we have here. Where the, because this has been a straight line move down. So if we take a look at good old King Dollar. Okay, so right now, you're not even at the 0 .382 retracement. A 0 .382 retracement will get us up to uh, 91,596. Bottom line, you still get, it, it's very weak. That's the real bottom line. So, oh, Peloton, P-T-O-N, Peloton, folks. If you want to see a monster ABC structure on the way down, bottom line, you have one. You're blowing away the B point. You're blowing it away at volume. And this is a big one, man. Peloton's going to get smoked. Uh, already has, really has got smoked. It's trading at 83, and it's off 171. That, one, that said, though, guess what? It's a 75.80B. Um, is it 71? Yeah, it's a 75.8 A to B that's going to put it at $50. Right now, you're at 8307 So you're talking uh, something that's pretty intense. When we get over it, when you take a look at where the $45 level is, that's where it looks like it's going to me. So Peloton, big problems, man. Stay right there, folks. And they had a recall. They had a recall of uh, hundreds of thousands of machines. Dow Industrials right now up 131. NASDAQ down 33. S&P's up 6.5. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.